All right, so the match begins. The match will be between Ganondorf and Snake. Snake seems to have the advantage here, being able to space out Ganondorf pretty easily. However, Ganondorf, Alice's Ganondorf specifically, has been known to win matches that should not have won. So we'll see how this goes. The advantage Snake has here is he holds a lot of projectiles and a lot of off K, so that's the first stop. But he holds a lot of options and ways of getting to Ganondorf without actually having to get to him. If he pressures correctly and spaces everything around, he'll be able to probably deal with him very decently. However, Alex managed to take the first stock with an early stage spike, so really, we're back to anyone's game. Looking for an up tilt to close off the stock, but not reaching. And using those grenades to really cover the ground. Gandorf's just looking for an opening, trying to find something that'll allow him to do one of his small combos, which do 40%. Going with a tricky Martina, but not hitting. And managing to sneak in a landmine for C4 that does the deed. An up tilt, but not reaching, unfortunately. Um, an up smash, which does manage to hit. Gives him a very good lead. Or tilt, he manages to put him off stage. Big 3 Tobias doing a really good job at keeping him in the air and off the ground. Which is kind of where Gendorf excels. He's not giving him any space to breathe. And that's working to his advantage. Trying to go for a setup here. Working. Going for an up tilt to hopefully get it close to closing. And Alex not being able to repeat the same stock. So right now it's looking very heavy into Tobias' favor. Uh, it could still be anyone's game because Yannin's been known for taking games early, but for right now, it's looking very good for Tobias. Oh, and going for a very high up there. <laughs> and Victory Tobias will be taking the first match, just like that. Hearing rumors about a Falcon Ditto, really looking forward to it. getting the early kill by not hitting, but by disabling Snake's recovery. Interesting. However, he's going off stage, so it might be risky here. Snake thrives at keeping Ganon off stage, especially when he's in a position like this, where he's lost all his recovery. Sorry about the tired stock. Ganon's main weakness against Snake is specifically the, well, all the projectiles, but also the fact that if he takes that jump away from him right at the beginning of his offstage game, he could be in some serious trouble since his options are very limited. Some characters have trouble punishing, but Snake with his projectile should have close to no issue and almost getting the shield break. Alright, Akita keeping him in the air. Um. Yeah, and managing to outplay him, but will he be able to do anything with that? Um, Snake using a C4 to close off that stock. Now, right now, it's looking cool. Okay, that was close. Use a side B, it doesn't mean to save the stock, unfortunately. However, Victory Tobias takes the victory. 
Two for Tobias.